I got a little bit of modifications to the camper. It doesn't stay completely on, but it does look a lot better than it did. But, though the back of it is slightly longer than I wanted to make it a time, I uh, cut the top pieces too short. Should have made it longer. <coughs> and it would have made, came out perfectly if I would have stuck with the original design. But I made it in two separate pieces. I made the top piece first over here, then I made the back piece. And the measurements from the top from here to where I wanted it to stop. Because I wanted it to have like a slant here so that I could get in and out without too much array. <laughs> but yeah, that other than that, it looks cool with the top on it. I can't go crawling with it because it falls right off. Right of that, it does a little good. It does okay. But once I hit rough, ter rough terrain, like crawling and shit, it's definitely not. It does not secure enough. It's it's really flexible too. It's very flimsy. It's just balsa wood with some poly dip on the top of it. Poly dip works wonders. I I love poly dip. I'll always use poly dip for for balsa wood, in particularly because it shrinks. It's like a shrink wrapping spray. I think it's cool as heck. And waterproofs are too. So that's a big plus, especially when you deal with main water and winter and all that stuff. It works out great. All right, well, thank you guys for tuning in. As always, happy trails to all you. Take it easy.